We are in Las Vegas. And this week, home again of the Continental Cup. It is one of the highlights of the curling calendar. Every year, the Continental Cup puts the world's best curlers in a unique format. Top players from North America team up to challenge the best from the world in four days of competition. Last year, right here in Las Vegas, it was a finish to remember. Now, Team North America returns to defend their title, but trying to stop them, a world team stacked with talent. What will happen this year? Welcome back to Las Vegas. This is the Continental Cup. This is the 13th edition of the World Financial Group Continental Cup and our third straight year here in Las Vegas. And the first day of the four competition got underway this morning with men's and women's team play. Our feature game was two world champions, Thomas Ulsrud, 14 world winner out of Norway, had an early lead, but then Kevin Cooey, reigning world champion, had this, the hit and stick in eight. They tied 5-5, five, five, so they split the single point available, but Team World won the other two games, so they have that early lead now, two and a half to a half point on a day when we'll see nine points awarded and three more points coming up as we turn our attention to mixed doubles. As on this Thursday afternoon, we say hello, Canada. Welcome back to Las Vegas. Cheryl Russ alongside. So here we go. This is mixed doubles, and we will see it just over a year from now in Korea. It will become the second curling discipline. Now, to be honest, Canada was a little slow on the uptake in this, but boy, they've gotten good at it fast. Well, they have. Curling Canada has put together a high-performance mixed doubles program. Jeff Stoughton is leading that. They do summer camps. There's already been four events on tour, and all the top teams are buying into it and loving it. And let's remember, too, as we see today, some of the top players in our country, they've taken to it because it gives them a second chance. Doubling your odds. It's too bad you couldn't do that around here, Vic. It's just fantastic for the top teams. You know, we think back 98 when it became an Olympic event for curling right. in Nagano. We all went, wow, you could become an Olympian. Now these guys have two tries at it. It's fantastic. If you're not familiar, here is the, uh, are the rules. It is fast and it is exciting because you only play eight ends, 22 minutes. And yes, different players will throw different stones. And there are rocks in play to start. And yes, we play the, the four rock rule. Now the captains, of course, got together prior to the event to make their choice. Paul Trulson, gold medal winner, Andy Kapp out of Germany, representing Team World. Deb McCormick, former Women's World Champion. Rick Lang, three-time Canadian champion. And they made their choices. And when we come back, we will have our featured game. And it'll feature Mark Kennedy and Caitlin Laws for Team North America. The 2017 World Financial Group Continental Cup of Curling is brought to you by World Financial Group, helping Canadians have better financial futures. The 2017 World Financial Group Continental Cup of Curling is brought to you by Home Hardware. Homeowners helping homeowners with expert advice by Ford of Canada, proud partner with Curling Canada for 22 years. And by Scotty's Sponge Towels, Purex, and Cashmere. Proud to support the Scotty's Tournament of Hearts. Mark Kennedy, Caitlin Laws, the rest of Team uh, North America on the ice for this opening draw of mixed doubles. There you see Rick Lang, three time Canadian champion. It's time to meet the teams now. It's brought to you by Home Hardware. Homeowners helping homeowners with expert advice. And representing Team World, Christine Urick, who comes off the Women's World Championship team of uh, Vinia Pelscher, as she teams up with Rasmus Sterna out of uh, Denmark, last year's runner-up at the Men's World, losing to Kevin Cooey, Caitlin Laws from Jennifer Jones' team, and Mark Kennedy off of uh, Kevin Cooey's reigning World Championship team. So the stone at the back of the rings, that belongs to Team North America. They won the draw to the button, so they have the last rock. 
A stone out in front. That belongs, of course, to Team World. And the whole idea here is that if they miss that opportunity right away to get down and freeze to the face of that stone at the back of the rings and possibly take the end away. They do, and you know, you've noticed a little bit of a different strategy with that now that they've moved that back four foot stone back to the back four rather than back button. His teams are actually choosing the option to maybe even just come top four because if the freeze is made perfectly, the team with Hamlet can freeze on top of it or tap and take it away. So there's been a little different approach. Now, the other thing to keep in mind here is all there. In this case, Caitlin Laws will throw one and five of the five stones to be played. Mark Kennedy will play two, three, and four. And each end, they have that option to decide who plays either first or second. Pretty good angle. Really good. Yeah. That wasn't bad. No, that slid pretty good, actually. I gave it maybe a hair more than draw the I think I remember okay. when I played it? this, how fast the end oh, goes. Like incredible. Somebody has to really be paying attention to, you know, you all of a sudden you look up and you're on the last rock and you've got no sight to the forefoot. So somebody has to always be kind of aware of when to bail. Okay. So similar situation okay. here where Christine Urich yeah. yeah. of the Women's good World Championship right? team from yeah. Switzerland will throw one and five and Rasmus Stierna will throw two, three and four find this interesting Three, too, Russ, is that well, okay. they, they took a while right to figure now. out good what well, game it should, or how you should call the game. So Sterna now as the thrower is actually calling well, line from his position right. rather than being right. at the, uh, the house. Hard. Yeah, I like that because it's, it's, you know, it gets the pressure in play right off the bat and it's, it's a little foreign for the not having somebody holding the broom, but you, every, all the teams have done that yeah. in practice. So you throw without a broom all the time, and in case of uh, well, Rasmus, like he's used to calling yeah. his own rocks on the way down. But I think for him, he's the question mark in this whole event, in my opinion, for, on the men's side. Unbelievable little, world championship uh, last year. Uh, only managed to lose it to a close game to Kui, who was on fire. He would have been the world champion. Then he was just off at the Europeans. So. The one consistent thing with him, you'll see a bunch of outturns. You've seen one already, and that's his go-to shot. And uh, Mark will know that, because Mark's played him, scouted him. And uh, it'll be interesting if they can keep him away from his favorite outturn side. Now, one thing the coaches have uh, made note of and taken note of. Not curling. Caitlin Laws and the team played. Jennifer Jones played on this sheet, so Caitlin Laws has a little bit of inside as does Yurik because she played on it as well on this sheet C. Oh, and the only yeah. player that didn't play the last draw was Rasmus, so that's another yeah. disadvantage. You weren't even on the ice. Well, I thought it'd be fresh, so I didn't want to. Yeah, me too. Sorry. He's going to run the center anyway, so. Yeah. I think it's still good. For, I mean, you can rip or run. Is he playing the double? Yeah. It's a flat double that Mark and uh, Caitlin are looking at uh, Rasmus to make that left yellow one off to the center. He's got to whip it. Seven. Rasmus Stierna. Whoa. Whoa. Right up. And roll it in. No, he'll get to the T line, pull in the eight. So let's take a look at the keys of the game in mixed doubles. Well, no different really for traditional game or mixed doubles. Control the top eight foot, you have to do that. But you also need to remember the power play and when to use it. That's one of the big things for the team to really not forget because it's critical. The keys to the game are brought to you by World Financial Group, helping Canadians have better financial futures. So, what is that power play? Well, as right now, when you start the game, you start with the two stones, one in the house and one out in front. Well, if you elect to do the power okay play, you basically take that to a guard situation, one in the house and one a corner guard. And you would use that Russ win. Well, it's certainly a, 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 the only team that can use it is eligible to use it, the team with hammer. And the team with hammer would love to have a one in behind a corner guard. A, there's nothing in the middle, so you should score with little, little risk, and you have a chance to score big because you already have one buried around a corner. So it's, it's an offensive play when you need some points. It also works when you're winning because it keeps that front open if you have hammer. Mark Kennedy. Could get the side one. Oh boy, watch where this spills. Ooh, that was unlucky. I don't know if it spilled uh, far enough to be shot. That still remains. 
shot the next three. The Yellowstone center line back four, and that belongs Shoot, to. Sorry. That's okay. It's if I rip that, they will die. Maybe take it. Caitlin yeah. Laws and Mark Kennedy. Rasmus Just could throw it hard enough to hit that red one uh, no. at the one o'clock position. Said four goal. here, Cheryl. Okay. Three, three for sure. No, it sounds good. Okay. Same land. Did, yeah, I'll just fire it, yeah. Yeah. Probably center, dead center. Yeah. Hope this spills. Sometimes well, we find with the, the, uh, the, left, like the world there. team, yeah. and in particular the game on uh, the middle sheet today, where you've got Thomas Ulzer, the Norwegian, playing with Yorika Yoshida from Tokoro, Japan. They're English, and their the conversations may be a little bit short. There they are. But in this case, when you've got uh, Christine Jurek, Rasmus Sterna, both of them proficient in English, so no yep. communication problem. Heart! 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 And away they go when they're sitting two. Not really a good throw. You just had to hit it on the other side of that rock. It would have cleaned that yellow one off also. Now it's a good chance for I have to sweep on the other Kennedy side. Kennedy here. Yeah, yeah, I have no chance. Well played. That's okay. He went to the end turn there and hooked it. I did, and he, mm -hmm. he loves his own turn. Mm -hmm. He knows. I think probably been a little bit better, but. Yeah. Let's go down here. Went from a chance to sit four with two red ones at the top of the uh, house you know to a chance My to. My other one didn't curl much. He can probably give me less. Tapped his back and uh, set up a potential two. No, 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 no. Close. Whoa. 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 No, 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 no. Yep. Yep. This yep, is yep, the yep. final stone shooter, for Kennedy, shooter. and he'll run it back and get them both. <laughs> Very nice. So there is some. There is some method to this, shooter. I'm shooter. assuming. You prefer? No, I like that. I like Just that. because of that Thank ability, you. not throw the little no disrespect to the a women's it. ability. But because you've got those rocks in play, you might want the male, Kennedy, throwing two, three, and four just because of that. Yeah. No, no question. You, 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 good, if yeah. it's Mark Kennedy, you want him throwing all five. <laughs> it's uh, not like Caitlin couldn't make that shot either, but that that is is the theory. The guys throw it a little harder. Uh, there, so Mark throws a lot of takeouts. He's played second for a while, third for a lot of it, his time. And uh, Caitlin skipped the start of her career. Yeah, I th you got to give Mark the, uh, the nod on that one. Gotta well played shot. Vegas, right? This yeah. end ever turn around. Did you know? And one of the other things I noticed with mixed doubles is you really have to communicate the throw because there's no broom holder down at the other end good. saying you know well they were wide on this one. You have to be honest with mm -hmm. your other player when you're putting down the broom for their yeah, next shot. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go. Go, 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 go. Christine Nudek, her final stone, and then she'll hit it too thin and spin out. So it'll be a chance for three. This is the amazing part of this. It's unbelievable with five rocks. Rasmus throws it well. That's okay. They're sitting four. Yeah, this is no this chance is to score a two, oh, and, and now they have a free draw for three. Uh, he needs a piece of the white. Bite the eight foot. Similar. Once again, we're playing eight ends. Each of these games is worth one point. We will not break ties as we did this morning. We in that 5-5 five, five tie between Cooey <laughs> and Olsrud. I'll let you take that nice in. Job. And Kennedy will but take I'm it in there. for the three in a turnaround. One shot by Kennedy, the miss by Urich. T North America puts three on the board. Here are the other uh, games on the ice. Santa Hasselborg from Sweden. She won in women's team play earlier today. Oscar Eriksson from uh, Nicholas Adin's team against Jamie Sinclair and Corey Dropkin out of the U.S. And uh, Team World has taken an early lead. Hasselborg and Eriksson. On sheet B, right in the middle. This is the one we mentioned. Thomas Ulsrud, Norway. Yorika Yoshida from Hokkaido against Don McEwen 
and Ben Hebert, and it is an early advantage there for Team North America as uh, McEwen and Hebert score three, as did Caitlin Laws and Mark Kennedy as we go to the, uh, the second. And again, the Stones are in play. Team World has elected to take the hammer, and so the shot rock is World, and it is in the rings. It is center line, back four foot. So this opportunity here will come up a little bit light. And now they're staggered. I can't hit you. Somewhat right? staggered, no, no. and uh, yeah. that missed opportunity, Russ, to come down and so get into the rings and come to the face yeah, yeah. of that shot stone. It's unbelievable how important that first come around is. If you lock that in perfect, you get a realistic chance to steal, certainly force the other team to a single. And all of a sudden, here's a second one looped okay. underneath, possibly. With see, hammer, and it could get ugly for uh, Kennedy. Oh, it's yeah, yeah. So it's, it's okay. the same That's situation fine. here with Caitlin Laws throwing one and five, Mark Kennedy two, three, four, and in the go, case go, go, of go, Team go. World, go, 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 go. Christine Urick one nice and team. five, <laughs> Rasmus Stierna two, three, and four. Well, it seems in, in this style of play, too, in mixed doubles, that threes are pretty much as common mm. as a deuce in traditional got, because you're already play. starting with a rock buried, nine. even though it is behind the button in the rings. But three is huge, isn't uh, it? Because you only have five yeah. each end to catch up. Yeah. <laughs> it's tough to put those on the board. This, too, is interesting because usually you throw to a brush. Mm -hmm. You think about when you practice, you pick the edge of the eight, the edge of the 12, the edge of the four, and you practice your turns. So in some respects, uh, this is almost what they would do in practice. Exactly, exactly. And I, I encourage that if you're uh, playing. Don't always throw to a broom because you can get mesmerized by trying to get the line and not get the right weight. What's gone wrong here for Kennedy and uh, Caitlin is the wrong speed. It didn't matter where the broom was. Both those were underthrown. And I was talking to some of these players that are playing mixed doubles more now, and they do actually go back and practice. They're finding some things that they practice specifically for mixed doubles. Mm -hmm. So they throw to uh, Mark on the eight, back boards. They're trying to, you know, do all those nine. things that Maybe would help five. them with this game specifically. Maybe two eight. Okay. When we first started, when we first watched this uh, many moons ago, they, yeah. most of the teams would have somebody hold the broom, run out and start sweeping it. Almost everybody across the three sheets here is doing exactly what uh, both the teams are in our TV sheet. Nobody holding the broom, and the brusher can start right away. Yep. I like that. No, 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 it's We want to go. We want to go for line. Line's tight, line's tight. Go. Go, go, go. Whoa, whoa, whoa. We're on the yellow. Okay. Hopefully. That's not enough. No. Wait, good, but it's going. I was almost edge for 12. We saw that on sheet B today in our first uh, game this morning on how much swing there was. And any down, if you're down a weight a little bit and you've got no hope to hold it. Four, two. I had more. Big Mark arm. Kennedy. Room. This looks much heavier, but everything's been coming down whoa. here. Whoa, whoa, you're heavy. Whoa. Whoa, wait for it, wait. Yep. Right to it, Caitlin, right to it. Keep going, keep going, keep going, keep right going, keep going. Right to it. Right to whoa, it. Whoa, 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 whoa. And to the pinhole. That's so good. You're almost throwing outside your comfort zone. It's a little slower yeah, in the first couple time. of ends. Yeah, it wasn't like you draw to practice. No, not, not at all. all. Yep. Should have got you off. Yeah. Right to it, Caitlin. Right to it. I'm saying that it's uh, keep going, not like keep going, it was keep going, in keep practice. Keep going. Keep going. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah. Shot. Thanks. Right, just at bite four. So, okay. So big, top four. Okay. Well, you just find Cheryl too. In the, yeah. No, I want. I want case, to go. Uh, Christina and okay. Rasmus is. We can run it in. One of them will throw up an option, and the other one will throw up an option, and you're you're almost like you've never played together, so you, you're both too polite to kind yeah. of. And, and next thing you know, you run out of time, right? It's kind of like the first year you and I worked together. Well, there together. you go. That's right. <laughs> so top eight, a little bit fast here. No, I know What's it's. Yeah, I tried to forget. <laughs> yeah, that's me. <laughs> both running out of time. Yeah. I'll give him one more. 
Rasmus is actually going to, it's kind of a two point option here. Come right around and tap Mark's good. rock, or yeah. maybe wreck on that top red yeah, one, go yeah. split them around, then they'll have an angle raise. It's way out. Yep. Not heavy. Go, Christine, go. That's dead. Think very hard to understand how much weight Mark threw on yeah. that stone. Yeah. He whipped it. He did. Or just for the Maybe a little bit for the. Maybe not a line. Maybe just a little bit. the same problem in the beginning. Maybe just a little bit loosen the hand. Yeah. Yeah, maybe. Get off the same line. Yeah, I'll give you the similar throw. Yeah. Team North America has been going around and all the in turn side, out turn for Mark because he's left handed, but that's forcing Rasmus to the turn he doesn't want to throw. Bit of a push, though. It's the second in turn he's missed so far. Line's good. Line's good. Easy. Easy, easy. picks him up right away. Easy, easy. easy. Oh. Second rock down this oh. exact ah, spot. I overcooked it. No. Oh, go back a little bit, eh? And he'll slide back. Boy, if he stops a little Sorry, higher, there may be a Sorry. double there. Sorry. That's the hardest relax, thing when you're sitting at home, isn't it? That, you know, it looks like Mark just didn't throw a good rock, but it, he probably threw the same speed he did in his first one. It's just getting that a little bit quicker there. Well, Caitlin even said she got on it too. You know, you just think you should, and with this amount of curl, you have to, but it second rock down. Maybe if, if, maybe if I even I could get the red, you can just skip this one out. Okay. Okay, six? Yeah, it'll be fine, full far. Yeah. Yesterday in practice went quite straight there, so maybe not my choice. Yeah, a tiny bit more. More? No, that's fine, that's fine. This is where you look at it. They've only got two rocks left. Yes. And they've got a whole punch of granite to move to try to get in and at least score. Right now it's a stolen point for Team North America. Laws and Kennedy. Who have the advantage, of course, having played together as part of the uh, mixed doubles circuit. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. World teams put together for this event oh. and then he'll run it by and he'll leave it staggered. That was just tight. They, they've had that quite a tight. bit yeah. of success too, Vic. They're what sixth on right. what they call the Canadian the mixed doubles ranking in Canada. <laughs> so where are they? Done well. I'm not there. <laughs> oh, sorry. Look at Rasmus though, he can hardly talk. He swept so much. It's, 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 yeah, it's yeah, it is kind of element that uh, he's not used to. He's a better shape than I'll ever be, but it's just different for him being a skip. You know, it reminds me of uh, but I, I think it'll bury. some it'll bury. of the uh, biathletes who do the cross country skiing, mm. then have to get in that prone position to shoot and are conscious of their heart rate and to bring it down before they fire. Sure. Here, same thing. You've brushed the stone. Now you have to yep. get yourself ready to throw. No questions. And it's definitely affected him here already. Lots of lines. Okay, it's busting now, yep. Mark Kennedy, head Mark. up, head down. You can hear Caitlin calling line Mark, from go, 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 where go, go. she is. You got it. Hard Mark, go, One more, go, Mark. Go, go, Get go, it by go. one more. Listen to the crowd. One more. How about one more? Another one. You got another bit? Yes, you do. <laughs> Man. Mark Kennedy into in like in to nicely. sit two. Myself after my, uh, you got it. Look at that Fire guard's Mark, a foot go, off go, the center go, line go, and it crosses and gets to the center. Your turn. Look where that is, Joe. Yeah, I thought you got out there. Yeah. Pretend and there weren't any guards there except the very top That's one. Yeah. It's wide open it's by 18 so inches. <laughs> <laughs> the other side. I would think so. yeah. I don't know what he does. I think she can <laughs> force us to one, I think. Oh, that'd be a good shot. That would that be a great draw. Certain try across this from Caitlin. That's okay. They're trying to grab a, as much of the button as they can see, and that would be likely to hold Team North America to a, a steal of one. Yeah, yeah. This curl's so hard. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Christine's yeah, yeah. got to go out wider, and there's a really good chance it's going to sparks or fly out here with this wide. Staring up. 
joins her. And this looks like it may die before it even gets to the rings. And it will be a steal of two. So a good start for Laws and Kennedy. Not a very good start for the world team of uh, Christine Yurik, Rasmus Stana. Yeah. And so they have elected to go to the power play. And we mentioned power play takes those stones, which are usually down the center line, and takes them now to a corner situation with the Team World stone, the Shot Rock T line, half in the eight, half in the 12. The reason for that is what, uh, Cheryl? To make the power play. Yeah, well, so the power play here is now for um, Team World. They now have a rock in the rings with a corner guard. Center is open, and they've already got an opportunity. They're not playing around that center guard again and getting forced. It's an interesting play because it can be used when you're up and when you're down. Absolutely. There's, there's merit for both, but I, I think it's brilliant that they, you, you tend to want to save it to later in the big important ends. There's not going to be a big important end at 5 nothing. No. <laughs> this is a big important end right here. Try to get that deuce, maybe a three, and get back in this game, get a little bit of momentum going. And just take the play away from the center line. And keep coming around to the button. So what Caitlin's trying to do, and this is the latest move with this mixed doubles, is, is trying to tick it. No. That opens up the back one and sure. brings the play back to the center. She wanted to tap it a little farther, but great stone, just the same. I love that call. That's fine. Absolutely. Ace, now you'll be able to see it. Yeah, good. yeah exactly. <laughs> Came down. Too. Sorry, well, yeah, I wanted you to hit it early and then it just stayed Stopped there. curling and died. Yeah. Came down a bit too. Yeah. Usually when it comes down like that, it'll curl. But... Shoot. The power play, the other Needed thing more it does too that ice. we don't think about is it now forces the opposition team, which was Team North America, out to a new spot, to yes. a new path. Yeah. They hadn't thrown out there. Yeah, brilliant guess by Caitlin there. Yeah, that's yeah, yeah. Threw, threw it down the weeds there and still managed to move it out of the way. It's really, she really made a peel. And teams only get to one opportunity per game. So this is uh, the only chance. Wait, it's good. Wait, it's a little big. For Team World. It's a little big. In some ways, by tapping it just a little bit, it opens up Mark's hit, obviously, but then this rock will be close to the other world rock and there might be a double eventually. It's so dead over there. You gotta get it there. Oh so I'm good. Not sure if it's better when we clean a little bit. Just sweep, yeah. Okay. So I had the feeling I it's not that good. Yeah. But that was 270. I thought that would well, be Well the team of Hasselberg and Erickson with a steal of uh, one in the second have a three nothing lead there. And Yoshida and Olsrud have come back with a single in the second. But it is still McEwen and Hebert. Line's good. Go room. There, 3 1. Line's good. Gotta go. Room. 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 Don't gotta go. I like the world play coming up short there, Cheryl. Do five. you really? Why is that? Well, 5 0, and they can't hit it yet. Rebecca's it's still in that free guard okay. zone. So, so it just, it, yes, right. this can happen. But there's enough shrapnel out in front that could yeah. help Team World like score really a decent good. end here. Sorry. That no, it's good. I, I gave you a little extra for sure. Nice shot. Thanks. I'm not sure they tried it. I think they played the come around, just came up light. They did. It was a good error. Would you have ever thought about playing to the open side and just splitting the rings? Or do you want to go right around this corner? I guess you could, but it's the most too early going to score is two. Too okay. That might not be enough here the way the things are going. I get a chance at a three. Hit the yellow one. So what way? Hack way? More than that. If you could ever tap the yellow one, Cheryl, towards the button. Fine. Roll and guard so the. can handle it better. Okay. okay. Leave another one out in front, or, or roll, or kick it towards. Is. Sorry, yeah. kick it towards the red one and roll towards center, guarding your run on the button. You do it either way. Just get a little bit of movement here. Okay, wait. Room right now. Close. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Yep. This could guard their whoa, own whoa, corner whoa. again. Whoa. No, they're going the other whoa. way. No, close, jump, hard, whoa. Oh. Through the hole, oh. and got it. And rolls underneath their own. Don't leave that man an out turn. <laughs> I thought they're ticking uh, nice yellow one. and rolling over. What a great play. Really good shot. There wasn't a lot of a hole there. Good way, 10 
And that extra little roll towards center line, under cover. Oh. I mean, That's why that first one short works out. Now it's a guard, right? I think so, eh? Well, and the amount of curl on this ice makes that hole even oh, tougher. Oh, man. I'll try to give you the same. Can't believe you even tried it. It's like a hair less to me, but... Yeah, slightly more room, but pretty good. You got room. Room, room, room. Easy, easy. Line's good. Line's good. Yep. Yep. Okay. Keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. Good sweep it. Great sweep. Wow, well, right to the yes, beautiful. nose. We saw that earlier today. Sorry, I kind of butted Stone's you out on that. Stone's moving up. That's good. I was coming in a couple of feet. Yeah, the fact that you would never even think that that had a chance to get right to the nose, and there it is. <laughs> the finish is really late, too, on this ice, and you get a lot if you've got the right weight. Yeah. Okay. Maybe. Back this, is, this is not the end of the world, right? Yeah. And then we spill it Absolutely. in. Absolutely. That's fine. Then I can maybe fire it on the next one. Which length? Back line, yeah? Yeah. Maybe head weight? No, back line. Back line is good. Okay. I give slightly more ice? And maybe a little bit faster than back line is good, I yeah. think. So well, it hits Do you have so. a split time before? No. No, okay. Sorry. I'll just make it off. There's a good conversation with two players that haven't played did together you before. Did you get a split time? No, I didn't, because maybe she doesn't go by split right. time. It's probably easier. Sure? Yeah. It's probably easier. We can still leave it wide. But then maybe too less ice and too much ice, right? Yeah, so we, still wanna, we still want to either hit the guard or hit theirs, right? Okay. So back it's line, fine. Yeah. Maybe, just, maybe just back 12. That's fine. Right? <sighs> maybe like, I don't know, 65, I guess. Yeah. Give it a lot of ice. There's the other thing. It depends too on what you're used to in terms of times and yes. throw. Yeah. He says 65, and she may be just shoving her shoulder. Right. Yeah. The yeah. Exactly. It's good. Wait, wait only. Wait only. Oh, oh. It's close. Well, close. No, 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 don't switch. Don't switch. We gotta go, Christine. Gotta go, go, go. Go hard. Hard. Go. I like to release that red one. And gets a little separation. Oh, I don't I just saw it like at the Vegas. Oh, it might be okay? might be batteries. I'm sorry. No, no, no. Oh, that's okay. That's I don't know. I just wanted just take it off. It's fine. Can we look? I don't know. Because red flash, Cheryl. I don't think it was straight out of my hand. Then I think I would notice. You're fine. I know. You stay out of the Cheryl. I will. No, no. Well, then I can't be mean. Yeah. Because I would see it, I think. You can't ignore it. Or you can probably get all of them. Yeah. The lights were flashing. I think it's a tough deuce. We are the normal, so Caitlin was a little worried it was a hog line, but I think it was just the bad thing. I don't love three, but. No. You just got to either outcount that one or. Okay. They've got two left. Yeah. I think that's probably our shot. Okay. There's the awareness. I don't want to They've be got two left. And, you know, really paying attention to where you are. Because then. Yeah, it's kind of a lie. All line. Yeah. You know, I. It's a little dangerous. I could hit and roll in right beside him. Yeah. Do you like that better? I don't know. I really like any of them. <laughs> yeah, I like this. Yeah. You've been throwing it. Okay. Worst case, off. I can hit that. No idea. Okay, so even top falls. Yep, top falls perfect. Rasmus wanted to bump that red-yellow combo a couple inches farther, and then he could pound away at it, get rid of that uh, North American rock. There. Probably there. They're all there right now. Room. Line's good. Line's good. Yep. Pass it if you can, Caitlin. Keep going. Keep going. Whoa, 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 that's good, that's good. Sit, sit. Maybe trying to hit this again? Yeah, I'm not getting it. Hey, speed. Because of the first oh, two man. rocks that are set up all the time, whether it's the power Marvel player, whether it's the two guards down the middle, two rocks down the middle, it, when you have to there's do this. so many finesse <laughs> shots that are extremely no, no, high degree of difficulty. Sure it's a great fast moving uh, game, it really is. Well, and you're more tapping stones around, you're never really eliminating. No. Or do you prefer this one? 
you like it? Yeah, I, I could I could make it, that's for sure. But okay. I, if I don't make it, we're dead, right? Like, they put it there. You don't have any. Then you have yeah. that, I guess. What do you think? Which one do you like more? Where do you have a better feeling? Both are not that easy, so... It's that's a good brutal, angle. That's brutally hard, but it is doable. But if I can pop, say, if I can pop the yellow just to the hole, I, I, I made the gap, right? So if we get that there, it's in the gap. Yeah. So we get the That's fixed good. four. Yeah. Let's play that. That'll give okay. Them a chance. They talked Back about nine. this, and 95% yeah. okay. of the curlers Slightly in the world wouldn't even have needed, seen it because you'd have yeah. to throw that so hard. Yeah, bit, so. Rasmus yeah, has that in his uh, golf bag. He's got that shot. Out that wide, though, a little fresh pebble. I'm not sure, but, it, uh, but they're going to go the other way now. They just want to release that yellow a little bit and have a chance to get at it with their last one. Then they've got some options to run in there. I guess one you could more. just play the straight come around, Cheryl. Not that that's a bargain. No, <laughs> it's not much simpler. Good. Three. Mine's good. Room right now. Well, the last of the uh, three stones Three's for line. Rasmus Sterna. Lots of room right now. Wow. No. Girl. That's too big, sorry. So much through it, eh? Um, I'm not yeah. sure if we have enough time. Yeah, you do definitely have to pick it up. We are just in the third. I think you three round see that a little bit more in the field. mixed doubles because you are rushing around that you'll see a lot more overthrows. The percentages are never as high because you don't have two sweepers, but you'll yeah, also mind. see players no, rush the yeah. just due to the time and okay. sweeping two rocks or three rocks, and you see some rushes on some draws. I'll see what I have. Yeah, you don't have your front end there to sweep, so you, you take you that into consideration, that. or you might be going to jump up and brush it yourself. So it just you know adds up to throwing it heavy. If you yeah. guard the draw for two, I don't know what she does. Yeah. Do you think she plays the off? If you, I think she can play the double. Can she play the double run? Double run for, for two. I don't know what you, like. you know when you I think now not only like this that in space. off that okay. they looked just, at. Just hit it. Leave her the draw for two. Okay. If you're staring at me, maybe saying now, we should have played it. Right. I have maybe that upweight ability right. to play it. Yeah. You're not going to ask Yurek to play that. Absolutely, yeah. You've got to, uh, what's your team DNA? And you've got to figure it out, which, what's the best way to do it. It would have been tough for him also, but now it's too late, you're right. Good girl, good shot. What do you think? Middle 12, 12? I don't know. Yeah, middle 12 middle is good. 12 is yeah. Unless she could make that in so off. When it's she might be able to. The beginning, yeah. I'd be well. tempted to try it. Yeah. I'd be Give her one of these. Yeah, you'd have to hug it. <laughs> Safe play here is that intern draw. A little quick right now. Whoa, that looks hot. It's tough for these athletes. Only the third end, and they're starting to speed this intern side up, and it consistently heavy all of a sudden. Dang. It's big. It's big. Okay. It's going now. Ah. Okay. And big it is, and all the way through again. And so it will be one. The power play does pay off with a single. But if you're Jurek and Sterna, you wanted more. Opening day of the World Financial Group Continental Cup and uh, nine points available on this opening day. Earlier today, the team matches. Team World taking two and a half to the half point split between Olsrud and Kevin Cooey. And three more points here in mixed doubles before we join you again tonight with more team play. So nine points on the day. So after that, a uh, single point picked up by Team World. Murdoch and Sterna. Shot rock back four center line. That belongs to Team North America. And Gabe Laws and Mark Kennedy. So they do have the hammer. They have the last rock playing the yellow stones. And to get us underway, this is Christine Urich. We'll throw one and five for Team World. Which big, which big. 
Okay, you can see good. the background mark and Caitlin watching every bit of that rock at the hog line, getting a good feel for the break point, the speed on that side of the sheet. So she bumped That's it. what the top yeah. players are doing. Okay. Still like that in, hey? Yeah, no. I think so. I think so. We know it. Well, and, and compliments to our, our program in Canada to, you know, we hadn't played mixed doubles, and now we've got some players that are really comfortable as yes. a team playing this. And that has been fast-tracked, as we said, in the opening. Okay, I want to make sure we're there. Okay, there it goes. Caitlin knows this spot. She had to draw the button here, and they've come around here a couple times. She made one brilliant shot here in the second end for that set up to see two. Keep it open. Good shot. Good spot. That's fine. Think short. Go, go, go. How to go. Let's go, Christine, go. So Sterna jumps out now to join Let's Uruk. Go, go, go. Keep going, keep going, still by, still by, go. Hard, hard, go, 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 go. Okay. You know, this okay. game, to me, it's pretty simple. Okay. It's, it's, it's okay. well, three of the four players in, played yeah. this morning. Right. Hit, the two the girls first, played right? on this sheet, no, off the bat. and it's really showing Erasmus. He's just struggled a little bit with that draw weight yeah, and some shots. Probably. And he'll he'll figure it I out, but it, I just it more could eyes. be too late. Yes, Colin, it would be good. Yeah. So I need to throw more. Yeah. Okay. And try to squeeze through. Okay. Do you want a sweeper or a broom? Uh, broom's good. Okay. Pretty thin to make this, isn't it? Yeah, it is. It's just want to touch okay. the center. Hit the center line one thin, ricochet on the low side of the second one, and Mark, if he gets it perfect, he squirts the thrown rock, the yellow one coming down here, right, right here. into the rings. I think a little more if I'm trying to hit a quarter, yeah. You want to hit just the center line. Just take the paint off that top one, it'll go. All on its own. Come up. It'll we'll be through the oh, uprights. Oh, we're not gonna like this. Move everything, touches oh, everything. <laughs> Sorry. A little I think lucky. You almost touched every rock. <laughs> Just don't touch every rock. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Very fortunate to kick that uh, red shot rock for the world out of there. Just wait. And Erasmus should have her figured I'm out now. He's thrown a couple draws. Again. Keep going, keep going. Let's go now. Gotta go, gotta go. Hurry! Let's go, Christine. Let's go. Go, go, go. Still short. Mm -hmm. <gasps> and I thought he threw more rotation it's on that really one, hard. too, because mm. I think that's been part it of it. On the corner mm -hmm. His yeah. rotation well, isn't as so much, and they don't just don't carry as far, but... Or do you want to double peel? Well, we're, we're up four width, right? Yeah. We just, like, blanking's no good. We're taking one the other way, right? Okay. Let's draw then. Okay. Worst case, you can do that on your next one. They've only got two left, right? What's that? They've only got two left. Yeah. This yeah, one. I like that. Okay. I'll take, take it up ice here. Okay. Speed looks similar. Take yeah. a little bit of risk here. Cool. Up four. You make this good. Team roll sticks the run back. You're in a little bit of trouble. Line's good. Mark talked about the double peel here, Cheryl. That would have been an option. Yeah. yeah. They then talked about blanking. They lose the hammer, so I think they've just decided they're going to make use of it. Good sweeping. Good shot. Good shot. Great sweeping. And around they go. Center line, top eight. Well, Hasselberg and Erickson continue to uh, pile it on. They steal another one in the fourth. They lead their 5 nothing over the American pair of uh, Sinclair and Dropkin. And McEwen and Hebert pick up a steal of one in four. So midway through, they're up eight to one over uh, Oldsrud and Eureka Yoshida.
Just nine? Or eight? Eight, okay. Eight and a half. Close. Yep. Hard! 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 Whoa, 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 whoa. Run it back, gonna catch it, he will. Let it be. <laughs> he got one back yeah, on right. all the <laughs> Yeah. Now they've let, he's left a couple of corners there. Staggered. Yeah. Shot rock is in the open. Um, you like board? Sure. Okay. Solid board. Solid board. A little bit of luck there, but it didn't hurt. To or do you, you want to hold? Go? Do you want to go open? Team North America's I, chances either. Like you, think you can hit okay. and roll. It's a low risk chance for the two. Caitlin asking a little uh, more. Mark Kennedy if he wanted to go to the op roll to the open side. He said, no, let's use those corners and we'll go underneath. Well, and I think the only concern of why you might consider the open side is this will be a little higher yep. in the rings and they yeah. could come around True. at all. But good yeah, opportunity. Oh, 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 oh. Ah, sorry. Okay. And he'll bang Not it right on the beak. <sighs> Shoot. I guess so. Uh, remembering that blank isn't really an option because you give the nine, choice okay. of hammer That's to the other team. Right. You might see Caitlin uh, just take the single here. Wait. Quite big right now. Okay, yeah. Wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah, 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 yeah. Come on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Very nice. And she'll roll in. And just pop out the other side. <laughs> Good shot. Okay. Okay. It's what's that? Full eight. Full eight. Full eight. Yeah. The whole way. Yep. Open enough Three that Caitlin more. could hit it, but why? You know, you don't. You roll out, you lose hammer anyways. Might right? as well take a point just, with just it. Just sink, sink one in here for anywhere in the eight foot. That's the other thing that you keep in mind here in the doubles that uh, unlike the other game, conventional game, if you blank, you don't hold the hammer. Mm -hmm. You uh, lose lose the rock. The other team then has the option of giving it right back to you to start the next, but uh, it's rarely done. So Caitlin Laws with her final stone will draw the center line back four, pick up a single point. Oh, sorry, Rod. We go to the break. Midway through, it's 6-1. The 2017 World Financial Group Continental Cup of Curling is brought to you by World Financial Group, helping Canadians have better financial futures. It has to be an advantage for Team North America with, uh, by way of the fact that we have three mixed double combinations on the tour playing in this event. Jennifer Jones, Brent Lang, Caitlin Laws, Mark Kennedy, Chelsea Carey, and Colin Hodgson. Rachel Holman, John Morris are currently number one. And there you see Jones and Lang. And keep in mind, the 17 world or the Canadian mixed doubles will be at the Nutana in Saskatoon, April 5 through 9. There will be 18 teams participating. Brent Lang is hoping to be there along with his wife Jen Jones and he's with Brock. Hey Vic, thank you very much. So Brent's obviously this is an exciting sport. You've won a world championship, you won Briar titles, but this is a whole different ball game. What are the challenges of mixed doubles? Uh, it's fast paced. You never non-stop. You can't take any ends off. I can't get caught staring up in the stands while uh, one of my teammates is throwing because I'm the only sweeper when Jen's throwing. And so yeah, it's, it's tons of fun. It's uh, lots of rocks. Tons of draws, soft shots. So yeah, there's lots of challenges. We're still learning about it. Sometimes the sides get a little bit different because there's not as much sweeping going on, not as many bodies out there. So the speed changes and it's, it's a challenge for sure, but it's lots of fun. And what a chance to go to the Olympics possibly with your wife. How's the dynamic been? It's gotta be a lot of fun. We have had a lot of fun, yeah. We've enjoyed it uh, right since day one. The first time we ever played together was the Continental Cup a few years back, and we've played uh, in this uh, every year. We've both been in it since, and now the, with the tour starting in Canada, there's been a couple of great events in Portage, and uh, we had one in Oshawa last year, so we've played four or five events together, and it's been lots of fun. So, yeah, looking forward to the next one. Looking forward to playing tomorrow, too. 
And we see you and Jen tomorrow, so best of luck. We'll see you then. Yeah, thanks, Brian. Thanks, Brent. In the meantime, his teammate looking really good, Mark Kennedy and Caitlin Laws, a commanding 6-1 advantage in our feature matchup. More from Vegas right after this. The 2017 World Financial Group Continental Cup of Curling is brought to you by Sponge Towels Paper Towel. Nothing absorbs like it. By Tim Hortons, official coffee of Curling Canada. And by Home Hardware, homeowners helping homeowners with expert advice. A recent Google survey found that Chinese cuisine was the world's favorite. Now, that's no surprise. However, what may surprise you is the Chinese cuisine at Mr. Chow at Caesar's Palace here in Las Vegas. It has quickly become one of the uh, Strip's favorite restaurants. Many of the top headliners come here, including J-Lo and Britney Spears. It's an intimate setting, just 250 people. It overlooks the, uh, the pool of the gods. There's the immovable sculpture they call moon and stars. But it's also the show. It's as good a show as anything on the strip. It's the noodle making. And if you want noodles, Kevin from Beijing will make them to order. He is a master at this. Make them to your taste. And it's all right here at Mr. Chow. It's great to be back in Las Vegas, third time for the World Financial Group Continental Cup. And so much to do here in Las Vegas, visiting places like uh, Mr. Chow, or using it as a jumping off point to go to Hoover Dam or up to uh, Mount Charles to go skiing, Red Rock. It's become quite the destination as we welcome you back to start the fifth in a game dominating right now in this mixed doubles by the team of Caitlin Laws and Mark Kennedy as they lead 6-1. And the last rock, the hammer belonging to Team World of Christine Urich, Rasmus Sterna. So they do have the hammer playing the red stones. As we check the numbers after uh, four, no surprise when you look at the uh, scoreboard and then you look at those numbers. Laws and Kennedy with the advantage in both. The numbers after four brought to you by Ford of Canada, proud partner of Curling Canada for 22 years. Weight's good. Health length. Weight's good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. What has been What's the length? What's the length? What's the problem for Wait. the uh, okay. the world pairing? Cheryl, in, to your mind? Yeah, it's, it's been the weight, and I think rotation a little bit for Rasmus. Like, they've got caught where his stones have come down a lot quicker than they've expected, and I think a couple times he did underthrow them and a couple times not enough rotation to get it to, to curl, and then maybe the communication um, or just, just between him and Christine and trying to explain how much more to throw. It's tough when it's your first time out there together and okay. trying to get that. And yet, you know, Mark Kennedy and Caitlin Laws have that advantage of playing together, knowing how to talk to each other, and they were just out the on the ice throwing. So, yeah. big playing advantage. On, playing on that big swing the, this morning made a big difference. Middle? You know, the rocks, yeah, we talked about it before, they're freshly uh, textured. They're really okay. aggressive. And if you have a little less rotation, it's a great point with Rasmus. They just played in and go. And the, the rock then plows a little bit. It doesn't glide like it should. It comes up maybe three, Don't four heavy, feet lighter than you think it's going to. Your feel's good. off. And... Uh, you Line's can't good. do that against a world-class team. Line's good to theirs. Line's good to theirs. Yeah, Goodbye, ours, good. Caitlin. Yep. 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 Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. You're not by. It's good. No, just a little rub and roll, but they are sitting two. A really good spot. Good spot, I think. Nice to move it a little. Yeah. Nice to chop Either. off a bit. Yeah. Okay. You maybe want to hit the one they just put. That's what what Stay North there? America has done so well. This game has been the weight, and you know, not a lot deep. They've really set up their draw stones. I mean, they made some amazing draws to get shot, and and then World hasn't been able to counter. 
I think the finesse players, uh, I think it's good the sport will gravitate to the finesse players maybe. Obviously you might need that double that run back. You, might, that, you need all the shots, but there's more of this type of shot right here where it's that soft tap back, get the angles right. And uh, you see a lot of the front end players just excelling too. Trying to just sneak it by that center guard they do. Real good. And taps it far enough that they are second like and third there. team world. Shotstone still nice belongs to no. North America. Uh, I was thinking, oh, Fancy shit. footwork. Wrong side. <laughs> you wonder as this game like builds where I'm maybe people so take up the game and they just really focus on mixed doubles, what kind of players that develops? Like what kind of players come yeah. out of that, just being focused on mixed doubles? Line's good. Line's good. Room. Line's good. Line's good. No room. Yep. Yep. Tapping. Hard line. Tapping. Hard line. Keep going. Keep going. You're not by. You're not by. Okay. okay. Shoot. Sorry. Okay. Went sideways. It's a pretty good spot. Mark and Caitlin staying on the offense here. They, you know, there would be an argument to keep it a little simpler. But that is, the, you know, it's yeah. the best way. That a good. Uh, a good defense is a great offense. More girls. <laughs> yeah. Before that was that ledge. Yeah. Rasmus Sterna. Good. Nice good goal. Yep. Hard. Hard to see. No. Yeah, you, you know what? Uh, and get the shooter might out be of crazy, it. but if you threw this with just a little bit more weight, yeah. And if this, I don't mind getting. Yeah, I agree. It's really good. And One get more? the shooter out yeah. of it. So what's what so he's down now? So I can yeah. probably play your outs again. Get his going. So the other one. You see. Forward. Do I yeah, want more weight? We just got to try to stick it. Let's throw control. Okay. I like it. Try to now because of the score, the kind of turn, move both those reds out of play, stay there, and the key thing is have the shooter roll away. Then there won't be an in off Probably a little for less. Team World. Yeah, that's good. You could play it softly, Cheryl. Just tap freeze, kind of force World to a single. I think Mark's looking at the score here, and it's soft weight double, really, is what this is. Yep, gotta go. That allows this Hard. rock that Mark Stone to roll Hard. away. Well, he didn't move it far enough. Shot rock is sure the rock going just thrown. Run. That's the stone top it's good edge yeah. of the button. The second rock shot belongs to Team World. He's trying to poke it open. Let that curl a little bit more, and they might have been able to kick that red one back a little farther, but it still ended up in a good spot, that top yellow one. Yeah, it's, you know, it's yeah. in there, and it's pretty tough to get rid of it, especially yeah. with the red backing. Easy, no. You don't like the just bump? Just enough ice, I think. How much weight? Nine. I want to throw more than I. Okay. I will stay on this side. Yeah, okay. I'll throw a seven. Okay. Good. Six half. Whoa, whoa, whoa. whoa. Close. Whoa, whoa, whoa. No. No. Didn't get the roll inside. No. Just really fighting that intern. I'll tell you that this is quite this? tempting. Yeah, the only thing I was worried about that is, is that if you ever clip the one? two, it's terrible. Yeah. This one's only helping us. I know. I'm just... I think this is our shot. Okay. Yeah, I mean, anywhere here, yeah, that seven's not going anywhere. Past the seven. It's got to be past the seven. Okay. You know what, Caitlin? Why don't what? you, you could throw this if you want? That would be you. true. Is it me? I hope so. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah, I've had enough. Because right now, <laughs> like if we go, you think that? Yeah, I guess it clips it. I'm seeing. I'm seeing if you know. Look, if he knows this. Yeah. If he knows it, or. You can only get one. The crotch. 
Yeah. She hits the crotch. It might be for to get a little bit inside. I like the draw. I like the draw. Yeah. Okay. So I threw mine here and got there pretty easy. We probably okay. need. The with the score the way it is, you, you, you would think they'd play something like this, but th this rock right here is helping Caitlin. So they're going to leave those alone, come down the other way, and just kind of nestle in there off that yellow. That'll, that'll set up like a double backing for the shot rock. It's a good call. Easier shot for Caitlin, less risk. It is the final stone for Good go though. Five good. Kennedy. Yep, really curling, you play here in five. Hard. Hard. Just right to the pocket, they need it. Hard. Kennedy has carried some great stones. Oh, sorry. You had it made. Sorry about that. Yeah, they couldn't get it there. Jeez. You play that though. Yeah, you can do it. That's, that's there. Do I have to hit? Hit, hit, hit that. Uh, oh, you yeah. had it. Oh. Hard. Go, 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 go. Sorry, you had it made. Sorry about that. It's always like easy that? as it looks. Not without clipping They've the They've been getting through holes, like. <laughs> yeah, it's true. Oh, dear. Did they set something up, Cheryl? Will that yellow that Caitlin just throw allow them to you pick out the shot rock? I don't think it'll go through clean. No, and this is his last rock, so. Maybe two. Yeah. She makes it perfect, perfect, perfect. Got to hit a quarter inch of this thing to hit the uh, shot rock thick enough to get through that red port. I don't. I think it's going to hit the right hand red one mm -hmm. first. But what else do you have? No, there's not an option here. Chrissy Nuda. Part of the reigning women's world championship yeah, team from Flims in Switzerland. Angle it back, touch it. Oh boy. And it's one. And it appears no. two. Is that two? Two yellow? Yeah. It is. Steal of two for Team North America. That's so good throw. Two yellow? Yes. Team the Laws, Mark Kennedy, extend their lead. Enjoying every moment of it, fans here at the Orleans Arena. Watching our first draw, mixed doubles, World Financial Group Continental Cup. As Caitlin Laws, Mark Kennedy, who play together now on the uh, mixed doubles Canadian tour, showing just the familiarity as they uh, lead it eight to one. That's Stone at the uh, the back of the rings. Belongs to Team World. And so that means they will have the last rock. Christy Nurek, Rasmus Sterna playing the red stone. Still can curl a little bit, but roll if you can. Caden Long. Yep. Look at that. Oh, that's like pretty good. Finally. <laughs> <laughs> Either way, it's moving. It's a nice team, you know, that we've talked a lot about Caitlin's attitude and Mark's attitude on the uh, their respective teams. Seems okay. Great combination. You know, and it's interesting how some of these mixed doubles teams came to be. You know, they hadn't played together before. I think they did a couple camps and some teams joined up. And I think a lot of chemistry. It, chemistry would be big on a mixed doubles team because there's only two of you and nowhere to hide. Yeah, no kidding. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Okay. You made a real good point last end where uh, they tried that uh, angle raise. R Rasmus decided to hold the broom as opposed to brush, and they could have used a couple licks of the broom there. Might have made it. What do you think, Edge? Like, yeah. Eight. Little less.
So if you're watching this for the first time, and we mentioned that this will be the uh, second oh, curling oh, discipline oh, in Korea, oh, it's good. the mixed doubles. Oh, 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 oh. And why you wouldn't just play a full mixed team? Well, there's a number of reasons. <laughs> first and foremost is likely the fact that uh, many communities wouldn't be able to uh, build two facilities required. Are you sure? <laughs> it's more athletes as well to house and to take care of. But also what it means is that you get countries that are able to uh, maybe not field full teams, but are able to find a couple, three players. So when you look at the world rankings, you know, right now you've got a Hungary that's number three. That's amazing. Within the top 15, you've got a Spain and Estonia. So, you know, in a... In a in a case of uh, Estonia, former East Bloc country, that's just learning the game. They've got two players that can play the doubles yeah, game. So. Yeah, but they wouldn't have enough to uh, compete. And, and reminders of those people who live in Lethbridge, the World Doubles Championship this year will be in Lethbridge, April 22nd through the 29th. The only other option is to get it over the top of ours and lose theirs. Yeah. It's going to grow huge, Vic. Uh, the younger There's players really should take a long look at like doing that uh, yeah. as much as they can. It's a chance to be an Olympian, and like you say, it's opened up the entire world to uh, an Olympic spot. It's, it's, it's fantastic. Oh, and I, I see it a lot now in the clubs where it's building there because of time, uh, mixed doubles leagues. You don't have to find three other people with the same level of commitment. Right. You only need to find one. And uh, it's not as much time commitment, so I, I think it's going to catch on just for oh, a lot for of sure. those reasons. Got lots of weight. Yeah. Keep going. Keep going. Oh, they get this by by the red one. Oh, that a girl. Great oh. sweep. Good sweep. Oh man. Good shot, Mitch. I was a little tight. Good scrub. I just thought it was going to curl anyway. I was anyway. worried. Yeah. Or just want to run the yellow one? No. I think the same with more legs. Wait. Yeah, yeah. Okay. okay. Yeah. Just incredible rock I need positioning. All, all we see about the red one. Yeah. Full red. No choice here to play a soft come around, graze by the yellow guard, try to get a little bit of Who's curl past the yellow to hit that red Whoa. one dead on, just to Whoa. just to Whoa. rearrange the yellows. Whoa. You're Whoa. still going to be th Whoa. third Whoa. shot probably. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, he couldn't get it around. That's what he hasn't figured out, Cheryl. No. Right? Well, you, he, you can tell by the brushing call he had it all the way down. It was like, whoops. Lo losing handle, starting to grab. Anywhere for Rasmus I need to get, get them going now. Yeah, yeah. there we go. Better move them. <laughs> get, uh, he'll get better and better as the oh, week goes time along time here, right? for sure. So a long time yeah, and that's something. Okay. Anticipating it. Well, I don't want to hit the two right now. Okay. Then let's, I like hitting that one. Let's hit and roll in then. Okay. You know, you know the best spot if we're picking a spot is roll right here. So yeah. that the three's going into something. Totally. Okay. I like it. Okay. Want a broom or a sweeper? Uh, broom's good, please. Okay. What turn do you want? I like my out turn. I don't think it's going to do a lot with weight. I agree. Yeah, that's good. You just think of your first how many times when you're on arena and same thing. Oh, I oh. waited too long. Sorry. Right. Oh, I waited too yeah. long. And finally, <laughs> you realize you got to call yeah. it a foot before it even gets yeah. close to the guard. It's that anticipation, yeah. isn't it? And you, you have to do it. You have to play on this surface you or do. these rocks to uh, to figure Nobody it out. Nobody can verbally explain it to you. Don't sweep it. No, I know. My goodness. And they'll tap one back, but okay. they are oh. sitting three. That's a little unlucky. Yeah. Now, if you hit this red one, can yeah, you sorry. move those okay. yellows enough I to score a bunch? I think you can, final. Vic. And then yeah, Rasmus has got that upweight ability just virtually at the one o'clock position or at the eleven o'clock position, that drags it over this way. This middle rock will spin, so it'll go. The top one will go, and that one's gone for sure. It's there, Vic. Chance to sit as many as well, two, maybe three, depending on where the thrown rock ends up. Needs weight. 
Uh, yeah. Bang. And he did touch the ball, but didn't move it far enough. Shot Rock still belongs to uh, Team North America. That's still in? Yeah? Yeah. That's still in, yeah. Not Not awful. Kennedy. Not awful. That yellow, go that yellow double Sorry, goes. Yeah. Uh, right. Over curled on him again, Cheryl. You ever just <laughs> do that? Yeah. If you if you nut it, it's perfect. Yeah. If you. I like it. Okay. Well, Sinclair yeah. and Dropkin yeah. for Team North America. I think it's easier to score two and five, but then Hasselberg and Erickson yeah. responded with three. They're up eight two. So at the, the moment, shooter. one point for so Team so World. I'll try to hit thin. Try Yoshida. To hit thin. Yeah. And Oldsrud yeah, have come back the right call, so. okay. with a three and a six, but okay. still down 10-4. So one point right there for Team North America. And in our game, it's eight to one. Another point for Team North America. So presently leading on two, trailing in one. I think it is. Just got to make one goal. You just don't want to hit half a rock. Thinner than half, thicker than half. So you try to hit a third. Yeah. And what Quarters, kind of weight? Nice. Firm. Firm, OK. I think that's easiest. Sure. Just right off the edge of it, basically. Good shot. Ah. Uh, I think. Yeah. Shoot. I think there's a double there. Boy, well, I tell you what, is. you really have to cut this off the face. Bad though. luck. Yes. Yeah, sorry, we backed it up and I mean, then we Without had nothing, touching that red and moving it far yeah. enough? Bad yeah, luck that's, you, yeah. Bad luck where you spawn. Yeah, I think it's there, Vicky. Hit a quarter rock. As long as it misses that red I'd, one at I'd the back or even really. feathers the red one, you could sit three here. Bring that stone edge oh, of the uh, 12 at 9 o'clock into play. Exactly. The one, uh, the one in the center, half rock. the right. Yeah. You have to try it. The scoreboard's screaming. Mm -hmm. You have to try it. Nine is okay, but. Yeah, I think so. Nine is okay. Yeah. Give it a chance. I'll keep it. Keep it out there. That's good. Yeah. 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 Come on. Stand up. Trying to hold this final stone. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, he, she did it. <laughs> Christine Alec. To the applause of the world bench. Three. Indeed, gets three. Made it look easy. That's not the way we want to see you. We'll see you tonight as we get a look at the runner-up in last year's Women's Worlds. Satsuki Fujizawa will play Chelsea Carey, the reigning Canadian champion. We'll have it for you at 9.30 p.m. Eastern Time on TSN 1, 3, and 4. Ah, oh, yes. We have a power play. And the power play now being used by the Team North America. in Laws and Kennedy. Earlier we saw the power play used by Team World to create some offense, trying to draw the play away from the middle so that they might score some multiple points. Here, the power play okay. is being used defensively Indian. by the uh, Team North America. After having just given up three, they're okay. saying, you know yeah. what, the only chance yeah. the world has to come from behind is if we keep up those center guards. So we want to draw the play away to the wing. Well said. That's exactly it. You you have best of both worlds here with the scoreboard the way it is. They've got one buried and it's off to the side, and that's what we always call the low risk deuce. You've got the one buried. You've got the front virtually open. No choice for the world to throw up the center guard. And there's only that one guard to worry about. Really good time to use your power play. Yeah, it's interesting to see it in a game used as defense and offense. Yeah, yeah, it really is. Just fight the four. And these are the type of situations where you can give up. If you're the world, you can give up a four or a five. You know, they're going to be going all out. And look at the start here for the team with Hammer. It's already too buried. 
Good spot. Oh, Slid pretty good. I threw less than I wanted, actually. Yeah. yeah. 285, something like that. Okay. Just a wee bump, right? Yeah. Pretty specifically. I would take it. This nice is the good. type of situation that yep. you could you can co Line, score you six and only throw five. Too <laughs> full. Light again. He just does he's just not believing it. No. Come on, go. Whoa, 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 whoa. I get it. Okay. Is that slow? Really? Yeah, maybe sure, big. So. Yeah. I, I feel like the outturn is a little more natural. Is that wrong? Outturn half rock? Which is? My outturn. Yeah, <laughs> that way. It's <laughs> the lefty. <laughs> this way? Oh. <laughs> half a rock, you're missing this. Pardon? Half misses it. No less than half? No, yeah, I need like three quarters. Oh, half's missing, okay. Yeah. Gotcha. I got you, Cat. Real close. We've, we've seen the women throw one and five the entire game. When the game we weren't watching yep. is in that middle sheet, and I pointed out to Cheryl during the break that yep. Team World, Olsrud, and Yoshida Hard. scored three points when Olsrud threw one and five. Go. That last shot being Hard. the important money shot, and you have to... You know, and I'm just wondering if, in fact, we might see that it's a little bit more often, that if, in fact... No, I'm not like saying here like, that oh. it would have been a little different if yeah, Sterna had been throwing yeah, one and five. Yeah. But I'm just curious if you might say, let's try that. Let's change things up and give that go. Absolutely. There's no question about it. And it's not like you know anybody out here could, they can all throw that big fifth shot and they, they can all hit, they can all draw. And it's, it's, it's just that little bit of a, when, when I played it, I wanted to throw three in a row. I just, I just, I didn't like throwing one sitting around right. for ten minutes yeah. throwing the last one. Yeah. I just, I, so I, I was just being selfish. And I, I wanted to throw three in a row. So I think, I think teams talk about that too. If, if you're a lead, maybe one and five makes a little more sense. If you're, you know, I, I think, in Mark's case, uh, he's played middle of the lineup or, you know, third most of his life. I think he likes three in a row. Thanks. When they first played it, there was a lot of switching around. A lot of teams uh, went 1-5, and then they went 2-3-4 the and moved it around. It. I mean, you might have given Christine, because she'd been on the sheet and knew the weight, earlier. maybe True. have her throwing 2-3-4. Three, 3-8. Three, three, then gold. Gold then. Gold then. Wait, okay. Mine's playing. 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 You have to do it in the end. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Nice shot. Good one. And we have our first final, and it's another point for Team World as uh, Anna Hasselberg and Oscar Erickson are winners. 9 2 the final over Jamie Sinclair and Corey Dropkin. Now they're supposed to play the eight, but because they're mathematically eliminated by seven points. Uh, they are able to leave the ice. Nine to your final and another point for Team World. Just straight pick this off the button. A shot. Wow. But I guess you're right, Rose. I mean, you do have to weigh, again, not that Caitlin can't make it, no, but 
where is the strength? Right. What are you, 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 right. you almost have to think, well, obviously strategically, where would he be best used yeah. on what shots? Yeah, and, and I think we, we, I know sometimes we sound like, you know, the men throw it way, you know, he, he can throw it a hair harder than Caitlin, you know, so he's got a little bit extra on a shot like that, but it, it, it's it's really personal <laughs> preference. And you might even go to the point where who's playing well, like as you just mentioned, Rasmus is really struggling. Maybe he should be only throwing two. Reach good. Good line. Yeah, yeah, take it, take it. The line, 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 line. Go, 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 go. Go, 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 go. Come on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go, go, go. We didn't watch it. We didn't watch it. Too much. Oh no. Don't. <laughs> Just the way his day's been going. That goes crazy. You're throwing this out, turn? Yeah. Make the final 10 5. Huh? John McEwen. And Hebert will pick up the win and a point for Team North America. Down by a couple, but remember now North America leads in this game. They used it all again for line, but should be close. Your T line. Okay, that's good. <laughs> Good shot, Caitlin. Got a girl. Good shot. Thanks, guys. Good game. Good luck this week. Good game. Nice to see you. Good game. And they'll add three more. Good game. And mathematically eliminate Team World. Make the final 11 4. Laws and Kennedy. And another point for Team North America as they win two of the three doubles matches on this Thursday afternoon. World still leads it by one. So, come on out. The 2017 World Financial Group Continental Cup of Curling is brought to you by World Financial Group, helping Canadians have better financial futures. The 2017 World Financial Group Continental Cup of Curling is brought to you by Tim Hortons, official coffee of Curling Canada, by Home Hardware, homeowners helping homeowners with expert advice, and by Ford of Canada, proud partner with Curling Canada for 22 years. It started very well and started early for Laws and Kennedy. The key shot is brought to you by Purex. It's Purex or nothing. First end. Well, and I think it's the key. It was the first end. And to be able to figure out the ice and where to put the broom down to make this perfectly. And it gives you that edge to get that point and that lead right away. They got three and they rolled to an 11-4 win. And the game's story really is that run that they had off early. Never really gave the lead back. And Team World struggling at 63%. The game story brought to you by Tim Hortons, the official coffee of Curling Canada. Mark Kennedy is with Brian. Mark, congratulations on the win. You get a full point for North America. We were just chatting off camera. That looks absolutely exhausting. Take us through the process of a game when you got four guys to the mixed process. Yeah, mixed doubles is tiring. Not, not only the sweeping, but the strategy. It moves so quickly. And for some reason, you're always more exhausted sweeping by yourself. So. Uh, it's a bit of a workout, and we've been lucky to have some games together in the past, so we're a little more comfortable with it. And, but yeah, you got to uh, got to eat well and hydrate during the game. That's for sure. We're excited because this is obviously going to be an Olympic sport. A lot of great athletes out there. What's it been like working with Caitlin? Uh, Caitlin's a great teammate. She's got all the shots. She's a good sweeper. So I think we're a pretty good team out there. And you know, we've uh, we've kind of learned the game together over the last year and a half, and and have gotten better and kind of learned the ins and outs. And yeah, lucky to have her as a teammate. Congratulations. Get some rest. Thanks, Brian. Vic. So this morning it was the uh, team world that uh, dominated the team matches as they picked up two and a half of the three points. Now this afternoon, it is. Uh, Team North America, it gets two of the three and they trail by one. Coming up this evening, of course, we'll have more team matches and three more points 
available. Mixed doubles, the new discipline at the Olympics on display here at the Continental Cup. Get out of my sight. Well, what would you expect in Vegas? Frank, Sammy, and Dino. And tonight, the ladies will be our feature team game. Looking for a little bit of that luck be a lady tonight. As we see the world silver medalist, Setsuki Fujizawa. From Tokoro, she goes against Chelsea Carey, the reigning Canadian champion. 9.30 Eastern time on TSN 1, 3, and 4. Team North America picks up a couple of points in mixed doubles play. So until we talk to you again at 9.30 Eastern time, thank you for joining us. World Financial Group Continental Cup from Las Vegas is here on Canada's sports leader, TSN.